Hello everyone. This is just a little segment to show you what I'm doing today for meal prep. It is Monday and I have uh, cut up some sausage here. This is not turkey sausage. It's not healthy sausage, but it's um, some sausage here, uh, Uncle John's, and it's got a little kick to it, spicy sausage. Got some peppers, broccoli, onions, and a little bit of squash mixed up in there. And I'm making a stir fry to make meals. And then I'm going to add my yellow rice in my container here, along with some broth in my rice cooker. I prefer using a rice cooker. You use a rice cooker for your rice, it comes out perfect every time, every time. And I use rice cooker also for grits. You can make, you can do a lot of different steamed vegetables in there. Um, let me let you see my rice cooker. Here it is right here. I'm going to turn this around so it's a little better for you to see. Here we go. Here's my rice cooker and my veggies and sausage that I'm steaming up for meals for my son and my husband. It smells really good. It's got onions and bell pepper. And I seasoned it up with some of this. I get this from Publix. This is McCormick Himalayan pink salt and black pepper along with garlic flavoring. And I sprinkled just a little bit of this. Sazon. So Spanish seasoning. But this is how I start out with my meal prep. Once I get in a certain section of uh, with the things being prepared and I set them up, I'm going to go through with you on that as well. Stay tuned. Okay, here we have my yellow rice and I did two cups of that in there and you're going to need four cups of liquid. Um, that would be water or you can use uh, chicken or beef broth. This is all I had in my pantry, so that's what I'm using. But you need four cups of that. And if I'm not mistaken, there's four cups in this container. Because usually I just, I don't measure it. I'm doing it now just because I'm talking to you guys. But that's two cups. And this would be oh well okay not quite two cups but this is what I normally put in here because that as you can see that's all it will hold but I know I put um, one container of the broth along with two cups of my rice and I mix it up and then I put a little bit of oil in there with it you can use oil or butter I'm using grapeseed oil just a little this helps to keep it from sticking and getting um, all gummy. Just a little bit of oil in there. And if you do this and you set that rice cooker, just you're just going to set it and forget it. And your rice will never be gummy. It will come out tasting great and looking great. So gonna plug this in 
and down here you can see this is uh, that's when it's off push it just like a toaster and it's on the lights not working of course <laughs> whenever I'm showing stuff <laughs> and put the lid on and it's going to take care of itself if you don't have a rice cooker and you make a lot of rice what are you doing <laughs> rice cooker is perfect and um, set it in Joel. We'll be back. Well, hello again. We're back. I almost forgot to pick you guys up. But um, just wanted to let you see my rice that has come out. And how nice it comes out when you use the rice cooker. It is all, there's no gumminess to it. They're all separated. Comes out really well. It's kind of hard to do this with one hand, but it comes out really well in the rice cooker. So I would recommend if you don't have one, to get one. If you make rice a lot. My family loves rice, so, and now I'm plating up everything. Again, this is sausage. Uncle John's kind of sausage. And then I made some mixed vegetables here. We have vegetables in there, but I wanted to have some side vegetables. And the rice comes out perfect every time. I'll be back with showing the meals once I set them up. Okay, <clears throat> here's the final video of uh, how I prepare my meal preps. Um, I did a short just a few minutes ago explaining, and once again, this is uh, Uncle John's pork sausage with some vegetables. There's peppers, onions, mushrooms, a little bit of everything mixed in there, broccoli, and uh, squash in there as well and this is how I box up my meals and then I they're gonna go in the refrigerator these are this is a little less than I normally make but um, I uh, probably will have to cook some meals this week because this is not gonna be uh, quite a, as much as I normally make for them for the week and I started on a Monday so but it's all good and thank you for watching this little vlog of how I cook my meals we will be back and thank you for watching and we love you and there's nothing you can do about it